Okay, so I'm in my 2003 Toyota Corolla. I'm not sure how many other vehicles this applies to as far as the Toyota goes, but for me, I had a real hard time figuring out something. My stereo and my clock went. Just the power just went, just, and it was, I had to figure out where the fuse was. And uh, after going through the ma manual, the manual honestly didn't really help me all that much. So I pulled this off, this little side drawer here. You probably have, if you have the same model, 2003, you'll have that little side drawer. I pulled it off and I thought maybe it would be in here, but it's not. It's actually underneath. You gotta go underneath, and I'm not sure if you can see that or not. I hope you can see it. It's actually underneath there. And it's a real pain in the behind to get to. But I mean, you can reach it, you just gotta lie down and get in there. And uh, the problem was this little, the little 15 amp fuse was broken. You can tell it's broken when uh, you can see it, there's a crack in it. If there's a crack in the metal there. So I had to change that. Um, for Toyota owners uh, of this particular model anyway, their spare fuses are actually in your engine, uh, under your hood. Okay, so all your fuses, this is another location for fuses, and your spares are actually right here. Okay, there's a little clip here. You can use this clip to get out your fuses. So now I gotta replace my uh, spare 15 in case I ever need it again, in case the stereo blows. But I had a hard time figuring this out. There wasn't many videos on it uh, for this particular model anyway, 2003 Toyota Corolla. And so you have your fuse panel here and you have your one underneath your steering wheel. Other models, you'll find it hidden behind this drawer. I know that for a fact. Uh, for this particular model, it was right underneath, and I had to lie down, and I got the flashlight under there, and I had to to pull it out with the tweezers and, and really get at it. But uh, the stereo works again. Clock is on again. Still telling the correct time. And uh, the lighter works again. Oh, that's another thing. Um, you'll look at this and you'll try to figure out where your stereo is. On this list, this is the cover for the fuse panel. Um, it actually doesn't say anything about the stereo. And I, so I just figured out, wait a minute, uh, my lighter isn't working either. So it's gotta be the same fuse. And you can see, uh, it says SIG, sorry. It says um, SIG right here. And so that's the one I changed. And sure enough, the radio came on. So I guess I blew the fuse via the cigarette lighter somehow, maybe with my um, a GPS or something. Anyway, I really hope this helps somebody. And uh, it is a pain in the butt to get to, but it's a little less frustrating, at least when you know what you're looking for. All right, good luck.